All right, we're here on Midwich. We are playing the pig. We are here because we brought ourselves here because we are already kind of aggravated about our first two matches tonight here in the middle of an event. Yeah, we're in the middle of an event. We would really like the event to be fun and, you know, have a good time and, and you know, just get blood points and, you know, have good competitive fun matches, you know, play to win, but not necessarily. Not necessarily make it our primary objective. All right, zoner back that way. You got a dead hard for me, Fang? That's a no. All right, hat for the fang. That's a nice quick now. We take those. Midwich is a small map. We can get away with this. No, oh, somebody's got an active trap fang. That's not great for you. She pre-dropped the pallet. All right, she's running distortion. This Meg is running distortion. We're not seeing an aura on her. Well, I have even less sympathy now. You're countering my build, Megan. Yeah, this Meg is running distortion. So that's a bit of a problem, maybe? Question marks? I mean, honestly, it's a problem for us with the mag, but not the fang. Oh, yeah, they're on that gen. Wait for Mare. All right, we know we're not going to see the Meg. Uh, Fang's trap still active? Oh, Fang got her trap off. And we are in Hold W Simulator. She is literally just holding W. Actually, I'm, she didn't drop the God Palette. I guess that's good. All right, hat for you. Please. Yeah, I think we're going to do that, Fang. All right, not a bad position. 
Be the second hook on the fang. On the bright side, they're breaking somebody's plaything, Totem. Hey, Vittorio. I'm just gonna kill the fang. You bird. Fang, I'm gonna give you apologies in advance, but we're killing you. We're simply going to kill you, Fang. Is that harsh? I think that's a little harsh. That's the way we're playing. Old Man Card, welcome to the stream. Happy Thursday. How are we doing? All right, that is the Meg. We know she has distortion, so we know. Right, Vittorio? Wait, you have it too? Uh, what that? Okay. Tried to grab him off the gen. Instead, whatever that was happened. Yeah, I'm I'm still coming, Vittorio. Just give me a second, all right? All right, Jill's trap is active. Yeah, Vittorio's running distortion too. So uh, half our, not half our build. Our build is basically been rendered useless by two-thirds of the people left on this uh, team. That being said, Jill does have an active trap. She's going to have to deal with that. And Jill is not affected by distortion. We can see her aura. Cussing doing rift challenges for Survivor. Well, we have had a wonderful start to our night. We've had two matches. We had a map offering in our first one to send us to Hire of Crows. And our second match was... Uh, our second match was uh, BMing Nia. So yeah, this has been kind of kind of fun so far. I love the fact we can see rift progression stats up there. Vittorio, I don't know why you're running in front of her. Unfortunately, we have we have no pressure from uh, from traps. All our traps are gone. You just ran me in a nice little circle, didn't you? All right. Yeah, we literally made a circle around the map. 
Oh man, car, thank you for the Prime subscription. Three months with Prime. Thank you so very much. Look, I know you're in here, Megan. So that's the Vittoria. Is my guess. So they're both injured. We're going to follow them both and we're going to go after the two of them. All right, we're going to go after her. We know she's dead. Our Amanda's letter is going to do us no good at this point once we kill her, but... Yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming. down we got one gen two gens gen in the courtyard gen upstairs all right I we know that they both have distortion but That bush looked awfully suspicious, Megan. Yeah, uh, if there was a pallet here, it would no longer be here. All right. Basement's here, right? Oh yeah, perfect. Magoon, we're gonna put you in the basement. Not quite as festive as it was before. <laughs> Wait, I hear him. Hello. You're oblivious, aren't you? <laughs> well, Vittorio, that's uncomfortable. We could hear him. We didn't need we didn't need Amanda's letter to know where he was there. We could hear him. And this one thing about distortion, it might protect you from my aura reading, but it's not gonna protect you from you being uh unaware of where we are if we're uh stealthy. Close the hatch. All right. We wrap it up. We'll take. We will take the 4K. And pretty solid match. Pretty solid match for us there. Uh, it kind of stunk that we had multiple people running distortion. Uh, the Vittorio had it. The Meg had it. And uh, that was a bit problematic for us being able to find people in the match. But uh, we got the Fang down early. We got pressure when we had both Fang and Jill down. And then we just got Fang out of the match, you know, as quickly as we could. Because despite having no gen perks, they were still getting gens done relatively quickly. Uh, they were running Fogwise. What is that? Fogwise and Stakeout for the Vittorio. Uh, stake out and fog wise for the mag. So uh, builds to let them know where we were, but not for them to be revealed to us. Now, here's the thing. I don't know if fog wise works when we're in stealth. Doesn't work if you're not on a gen. And in any case, whatever the case may be, uh, it worked out well enough for us. 
Uh, we've had a rough start to the night. Uh, BMing survivors, map offerings we didn't like while we were playing for blood points and envelopes, so we decided to play more seriously this round, and we end up with a much more serious result. A 4K on Midwich as Amanda's Letter Pig.